there are two questions on everybody's mind this week. One, why did I choose a school in northern Indiana? Seriously. And two, what would I do if I won the Powerball jackpot? Mm-hmm. That's easy, Kelly. One, buy Bethel. Two, pay to move the entire campus to Palm Beach, Woo! where it's 80 degrees. An important side note is that the girls' games will only be held on Thursdays to avoid a very important scheduling conflict with The Bachelor. This is not a joke, and I'm pretty happy about it. Kelly, get out of my chair. Walk home, in the cold. The Bachelor, seriously, he's dating 17 girls who think it's love. Last year, we did a segment about what it would be like if we had music playing in the background as we walked around campus. Now that winter's here, we encounter a bunch of new situations that definitely deserve a soundtrack. Like a bunch. <laughs> Say your life. Oh, right. For instance, two seconds into walking across campus against the wind. I can feel my face when I'm with you. Or the experience of using the ER lobby as a shortcut between Sailor and SG. Or the dilemma you face when carrying a cup from the acorn and your hand starts to freeze. Let it go, let it go. Can't hold it back anymore. Good morning, everyone. Today is a very important day. We've officially reached 100 episodes, Drew. Mm hmm, that's right. Come on out to Goodman to join students from the crossing for some cosmic dodgeball. Whoa, well, what? And hip hop fitness. Kelly, why don't you show us what hip hop fitness is? Oh, this could be interesting. It's probably something. Okay, sit down, please sit down. Before I have a heart attack. There will also be food. Haha, <laughs> breaking free 101. I'm still starting, moving forward. Starts Monday night at 7.30 in AC 342. Kelly, this is serious. Breaking free 101, Monday night. 7.30, AC 342. There's still be time to get signed up for more information, contact Bill Jones. You can also still sign up for the <laughs> the people who are going through financial struggles right now do not like that you're laughing at them. I'm sorry. February is just a couple of days away and with February comes all those feelings and stuff. And to get you all prepared for the month of love, we've brought back none other than Bethel's own love guru, Hello Bethel. All this talk about a month of love confuses me because to Guy, every month is a month for love. But for those less fortunate when it comes to relationships, I must tell you that Valentine's Day is only 16 days away, which means you only have a couple days if you want to break up with your significant other. But Guy, you say, Bethel's a small campus. How do I go and break a heart if I have to look them in the eye in class the next day? Well. Tip number one, use a classic reverse pickup line. Whoa, is it hot in here? Or is this relationship smothering me? If that doesn't work, try a joke. Knock, knock. Who's there? You're. You're who? You're single. And if all else fails, be thankful you go to a small Christian school because you can always pull out the God card. Well, I know what you're thinking. Why are you giving me such great advice? Well, that's easy. More breakups equals more single ladies for a gee. Oh, 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 o